Hi, welcome to St. Anne's Catholic Church. We've been um, hoping and dreaming for this to come to uh, fruition, and thanks be to God it has. I'm so thankful for our people and for their faithfulness, and um, we'll be here until the Lord comes again. We've designed it with beauty in mind and also practicality. We've doubled the seating capacity, and we have land in which heaven knows how Monroe will develop over the future. If we have an influx of more Roman Catholic faithful, we have room to build some more. So we'll be here until the Lord comes. I'm going to give a little history of the Catholic Church in Monroe, Walt County, and it started the history of Catholicism started a long time ago, but in this locale, started in the early 1950s with three women determined that they would have a Catholic church here in Walton County. And um, two of them have passed to their eternal reward, Claude Friend and Dot uh, Briscoe. But uh, Catherine Melton, whom you may know and love as I do, uh, is still with us. She was a young woman then, and um, they sold magazine subscriptions to fund the sale of the purchase of the property on East Spring Street. Before that, they had masses intermittently at the American Legion and other places throughout Monroe. But uh, we were at the East Spring Street location for 60 years. And um, this is a big change for us, and it's, it's beautiful. But it's also a challenge in many ways, because everything's a little bit different, and when you get older, change is um, a mixed blessing. But uh, this is a, a great blessing that we're adapting to, and uh, we'd like to invite all the Catholics in the row and Walton County to come and join us. We're outside under the bell tower now. I want to tell you that the bell that's above me is 100 pounds, and it came from the Howard Green family farm in Walnut Grove. It has historic roots to the family farm where it used to call laborers from the field to have lunch or dinner together. Uh, Howard and Pat Green donated it. Um, there's another bell above that that's 600 pounds, and it came from St. Louis, Missouri. And um, Ron and Helen Cantrell, the general contractors, donated it. It has a striker and a ring, different tones for um, funerals and weddings and for keeping time. There's another bell system, the Clarion system, which we can program to play music. And we're going to ring out. Um, Amazing grace this afternoon as we welcome our brothers and sisters in Christ to our open house. God bless.